Mr. Chairman, as you know, there are people demonstrating against Wall Street in New York City and other cities around the country. And I think the perception on the part of these demonstrators and millions of other Americans is that as a result of the greed, the recklessness, and the illegal behavior on Wall Street, we were plunged into this horrendous recession we're currently in. Do you agree with that assessment? Did Wall Street's greed and recklessness cause this recession that led to so many people losing their jobs? It had an excessive risk taking on Wall Street had a lot to do with it, and so did some failures on the part of regulators. Do you believe that we have made any significant progress since the collapse of Wall Street to suggest that we will not, either in the short term or in the longer term, once again see a collapse on Wall Street and the necessity of a bailout? Senator, yes, I, we, we're making substantial progress, although I would point out that many of the um, rules implementing, as you point out yourself, many of the rules implementing Dodd-Frank are not yet in force or uh, fully implemented. But um, I believe as this process goes forward that we will have made a very substantial improvement, yes. Well, I would respectfully disagree. You see protests are both on the right and the left right now. The protests that are getting the headlines are on the left in, in New York. What, what is that protest saying to you? What are you hearing from, from that activity in, uh, in New York right now? Well, I would just say very generally, I think people are quite unhappy with the state of the economy and, and uh, what's happening. Um, uh, they blame, with some uh, uh, justification, the uh, problems in the financial sector for getting us into this mess. Um, and they're dissatisfied with the uh, policy response here in Washington. And uh, uh, I, at some level, I can't blame them. Certainly, 9% uh, unemployment and very slow growth is not a very good situation. That's what they're protesting. And are you incorporating that into the, the, the remedies that you're proposing? I'm taking into account the, uh, the growth rate and the unemployment rate as well as the inflation rate. Uh, I'm not taking the protests into account specifically, but I certainly, uh, like everyone else, I'm dissatisfied with what the economy is uh, doing right now.